want to very quickly, you know what? Here's what I want to do. Um, you guys have all either talked about equations and inequalities or inequalities or expressions. What I'm going to do is give you uh, some index cards. And the last part that I want you to do here on this activity is to make up six examples. So turn your papers to the back side. Number three says you have to make up six examples. You guys have to make up six examples, new examples. They can't be ones that are already on the board that fit, that are either equations, inequalities, or expressions, and fit the different subcategories that you came up with. So here we got properties and solving for unknowns. Here, we didn't hear from it, but people in groups came up with different categories. Can anybody name the categories they came up with with inequalities, just so we can get some ideas? Yeah. Well, like the greater than and less than signs, like you could place them on another line, but like they can't be a solution itself because they're not an equal to sign either. But like the greater than and less than equal to sign. OK, they, so there are these ones. Uh -huh. and, and those ones. Yeah. And these ones. Mm -hmm. And those, the ones that are just the, um, the alligator things, those can be a solution, but the other ones can. OK. So I, I heard what you guys were saying. That may, may not make sense to other people. But what I want to show, can everybody look up here? Is that there are subcategories of inequalities, different types. So when you make up six, you could make up some of these and some of these. What are the different types of expressions that people found? Does anybody have a name for the different categories of expressions? Anybody do expressions? Yeah. I know you guys did. What, give me a name for the different kinds of expressions. Uh, we didn't really have names. We just sort of sorted them. Yeah. Like Into groups. groups. And how would you describe the two groups? Um, well, one of them would just be uh, like combining like Terms, I guess. Okay, so maybe I'll call it terms can be combined. And what was the other group? And, um, um, didn't really make groups. Uh, you said you sorted it into two groups. Yeah, but we didn't like name groups. But if this is the group that can be combined, what would the other group? Can't be combined. Can't, yeah, yeah, it's the ones that you can't do anything to the expression. Can't be combined. Okay, so. On your paper, I want you and your group to make up six new examples. When, you have, when you've started that, I'll give you the index cards. Anyone? You can, yeah, six to fit any of those categories. OK? But you got to do six in each. No, six. You got to do six in each category? No, six all together. So make up you know, one of these, one of these, one of these, one of these. Two, 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 you decide. Go. On here, you got to make up new examples that would fit within your groups that you listed here. OK? Come on, Malik. I'm looking at the thing for ideas. Good. Make up some new examples that will fit within your subcategories. And tell me what subcategory it is. Make up some new examples. Whatever variables you want, whatever numbers you want, make up some new examples that would fit. If I put them up on the board, we could sort them. Okay, and then out. Make up six. Make up six. I'm making an out. So you got to make up one example. Oh, no, exactly. Oh, one example. Once you get them on your page. Oh, once you get them on your page. Okay. Once you get them on your page. No, you don't have to solve them. I just want you to make up. Make up a new example that might fit. Um, for eight with like the something. others that are on the board. Why would you like 17 minus 2x equals 13? All right, you got to make six. You got to make six. No, you got to make six. Oh, does it have to make six? Yeah, uh, What's that one? Come on, random. Equals what? What? What's the letter? Oh, it's your group. Don't ask me. Yeah, there's a question. Oh, no, you don't have to solve it. You don't have to solve it. No, I'm sorry. 2y plus 11y equals 13. 
I really hope for that not even change. Yeah, it's too wide. Alright, I made an owl.